Hey, what's going on Twitter? This is Evan the Voice. Um, I've had a lot of people on my mentions the last couple days tweeting about backyard football and how they don't know how to get it to work on their computer. So I'm here to tell you guys that it's actually really easy and you can get it done in less than five minutes. So I will uh, show you how to do this. So to start off, you need the Scum VM emulator, uh, as you can see that I've said right here. That can be done by going to scumvm.org and... Uh, just go and click in Downloads and installing whichever version is right uh, for your Windows PC. It'll give you a recommended one here. Uh, while we're on ScumVM's website, it's worth noting that they have uh, compatibility listed um, for games that run on the engine. You can see here that the games that are officially supported are Backyard Baseball, the original 2001-2003, Backyard Football, original, and uh, 2002. So uh, I have Backyard Soccer also, as you, uh, you'll you see in my Scum VM. It's, uh, it works, but it's pretty prone to crashing. Uh, I've experienced crashes on two out of the three games that I've played uh, in there. Uh, it's also worth noting that uh, at least two times in backyard football, I have crashed a desktop at the end of a game when I click to go back to the bench. So uh, it does work. I've, I've been able to play a whole season just fine, um, but be aware that the emulator can be prone to crashing. So once you've got uh, Scum VM downloaded, give me a sec to close these windows here. You should uh, install it, see it on your desktop, and you'll go ahead and open that. Uh, it'll be blank for you, but I've got some stuff installed here. So once you've got ScumVM installed, your next step is to go to uh, an Abandonware website. I use uh, myabandonware.com, uh, and you'll just search for Backyard Football. Alternatively, you can just Google Backyard Football Abandonware, and you should get a link directly to this page. You'll hit uh, Download. It'll redirect you down here to download an ISO version of the game, which is basically a virtual CD uh, of it. And then you will go to your Downloads, and you will find uh, a zipped version of the folder right here. So all you need to do is extract that. So extract all, and then you'll open up the folder. You'll see the disk image in there. Click on the disk image to mount it. And then once you get to this step with the Backyard Football folder, you just open up Scum VM again. You'll hit Add Game. And what you'll do is you'll go down to this PC. You'll actually go to the fake CD that's being mounted, and then you'll just click to add the folder. If it's added correctly, uh, you'll see a menu that asks you what you want to name it. Should automatically name it Backyard Football for you. Um, just to be on the clear side, if you add it incorrectly, you will see that ScumVM will pop up this error message that it can't find the game. And then you'll know to go back and do it a different way. But if you get it added correctly, it should say um, Backyard Football, pop up a different menu, and it'll be right there. And you can start to relive your childhood in glory. So uh, hopefully that video has been helpful, uh, and then you guys can enjoy, as I have, playing Backyard Football. So uh, thanks for watching, and take care.